We're set for news extra now on KNEB. And program is brought to you by the Gehring Civic Center. Gehring Civic Center, Western Nebraska's premier multifunction facility, celebrating 25 years. Let's turn it over to Kevin Mooney. All right, thanks, Steve. Good morning, everyone. John Schmall is here, and that means we're probably talking about something going on in Bayard and uh, 2018 Chimney Rock Pioneer Days. Just a couple of weekends away, huh? Yes, sir. All roads lead to Baird starting on Friday, September 7th for 2018 Chimney Rock Pioneer Days. All right. Fantastic. And you guys got a lot of things going on uh, starting on that night. You got a beer garden that opens up at Library Park, and then uh, you got some other stuff as well, right? Yeah. Well, Friday night, the beer garden opens at 8, and Randy Eckhart and the Dutch Hop Music Makers will be there from 8.30 to 12.30. I had them a couple years ago and very well received. So if you want to come out for a Dutch hop Friday night, come on down. Uh, free admission to that, by the way. No cost to get in. Yeah, and that's courtesy of uh, Chimney, Rock, uh, public... Chimney, Rock, Chimney Rock Pioneer Days Committee. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, cool. There we go. There you are. All right, so you get done with that. You're probably going to bed about 12.30 a.m., 1 in the morning after Pretty you're close. done there. Pretty close. And then Saturday, you get up bright and early for the pancake feed. Absolutely. So we'll start off Saturday morning with the pancake feed at the Baird American Legion. Our local PEO chapter sponsors that. Uh, it's from 7 to 9.30. And also from 7 to 9, uh, we'll have a hot air balloon rides there at the baseball fields chimney rock public power and touchstone energy have brought in a hot air balloon for us there uh a nice new event for us kind of bookend the day with some free hot air balloon rides that's cool that's good so uh and then it uh you have the parade check-in starts at nine o'clock and then the parade begins at 11 absolutely um would like to invite anybody to come down for the parade, whether to participate or to just view it. Uh, check-in starts at 9, right by the swimming pool parking lot. Uh, we allow people to pass out candy, water bottles, flyers, whatever you deem appropriate. We just ask people to use good common sense. The parade starts at 11, usually lasts right about an hour, and then things kick off at noon down at the library park. All right. We'll tell you what's going on at Library Park after we take this break. Let your wedding reception be a truly memorable celebration by holding it at the Gehring Civic Center's elegant, calm-free ballroom. Your planning will be helped by professional staff who are dedicated to your event. The meat shop will delight your food sense with traditional or ethnic menus. There are no room or service fees with food purchases. Call 436-6888 or visit GehringCivicCenter.com. The Gehring Civic Center, the center of it all. Back on News Extra this morning, John Schmall is here. Uh, we're talking about the 2018 Chimney Rock Pioneer Days celebration. We've uh, gone through Friday night with the Dutch Hop and the Pancake Feed and the Parade and all that kind of stuff. Now we're at uh, noontime over at Library Park. And uh, what do we got coming up afternoon and evening next Next Saturday, Next on the, Saturday on the 8th. Yes, sir. Uh, once the parade ends at 12 noon, things kick off at the Library Park. Several craft vendors, several food vendors will be available. Uh, the beer garden opens at 12 noon. At 12.30, we'll have our opening ceremonies. We'll recognize our dignitaries, our award winners, and we'll also announce our parade award winners at that time. Uh, and then from... Well, we say one to five, but as soon as those awards are done, we'll have some live entertainment, have a nice lineup this year. We have Avid Discord kind of bookending our, our entertainment. They'll open and close our, our live uh, shows there. The Yes Ma'am Singers from right there in Baird yeah. will will perform some for us. Uh, the Natasha Bray Band also right from right in Baird will sing. Uh, and then a, what I like to call a Baird kid, uh, kind of done good, uh, Alexi Anist is a classical guitarist and will be performing for us. So very excited to have him back there on our entertainment stage. Uh, there again, those acts running from 1 to 5 on Saturday. All right, and then the other things, uh, some of the other things they got going, they have a horseshoe tournament and a cornhole tournament. Everything at uh, Chimney Rock Pioneer Days is pretty much free other than the food that you buy at the food vendors. Uh, but uh, if you want to get involved in either the horseshoe tournament or the cornhole tournament, 
you got to pay a little entry. Th there is a, a little bit of an entry fee. Uh, if you check out our Facebook page, there's a contact people and those numbers. I'm not sure what the horseshoe tournament entry fee is. The cornhole tournament, I think, is $20 per team, $10 a person. Um, we also have the Planet Bounce House in inflatables that will be at the park from 1 to 5. Those are free for the kids. We'll have some more hot air balloon rides towards evening, uh, weather permitting, of course, uh, courtesy of Touchstone Energy and Chimney Rock Public Power. Um, a family movie in the park. We've had this on our schedule the last several years. Been very well received. Up at the swimming pool park, we'll be showing Peter Rabbit. That'll kick off uh, approximately 7.30, as soon as it's dark enough for the movie to be seen. And then we close it all up with a street dance. Uh, Victory Underground going to be back down there after a one-year break to close out Pioneer Days 2018. All right. It's fantastic. And uh, all the sponsors for this, you got uh, your committee and then... Uh, a number of businesses as well, Yes, right? uh, Chimney Rock Pioneer Days relies a lot on the money we raise through the beer garden. Uh, also, a lot of businesses donate. Platte Valley Companies, the city of Baird is very supportive. Uh, Kelly Bean, Trinidad Benham, Paul Reed Construction, uh, Panhandle Cooperative Association, Farm Credit Services, Federal Crop Agency, and a number of local businesses that I didn't get mentioned that donate time, donate equipment, uh, donate employees to help us set up and tear down. So, yeah, and, that, and uh, the volunteers that uh, help out. How many people you got on your committee and volunteer maybe on this thing? Our core committee runs about seven, um, and we're tasked with making sure ev everything's organized and lined up. We utilize uh, the Baird FFA chapter helps us set up along with Simplot donates a lot of equipment and power for us there. Um, and then the different groups. The PEO chapter does the pancake feed. Public Power does the hot air balloon rides. Um, people of all stripes uh, help volunteer at the beer garden to man that. Uh, that's all run by volunteer help because uh, that is put on by the committee. So it's a, it truly is a community-wide effort for Pioneer Days. All right. Chimney Rock Pioneer Days. Make sure you kind of put it on your calendar. I know uh, the football game and everything next weekend, but you can probably find your way down there for a little while and uh, take take in some of that uh, activities over in Bayard. Chimney Rock Pioneer Days next Friday and Saturday. We thank John Schmall for coming in. Thanks, bud. Thank you.